from the Lightning, we have Yanni Gord and Ryan McDonough. Media, please raise your hand if you have a question and identify if your question is for Yanni or Ryan. We'll start in the Media Center with Steve Wino, Associated Press. For you guys who played two days ago and when the stars come out kind of hitting and, and trying to, to play the body off from the first shift. Steve, could you repeat your question? You guys were on mute there at the beginning. Sorry, uh, this question's for you, Ryan. It's just, what does it do to you guys as a team? You played t two days ago, and the Stars come out hitting on the first shift. Well, I mean, it's, it's game one of the finals. I would assume both teams are trying to come out and set the tone. Uh, I mean, I don't think we were surprised by it, but we needed to play at a higher pace and a higher tempo. and. Um, expect us to be uh, better in that aspect uh, at the start of game two. Next question in the media center, Chris Johnston, Sportsnet. Yes, Ryan, wondering, do you, do you feel that you started getting where you wanted to go in the third period? Was that the beginning of maybe getting to, to your best game? Uh, you can't just do it for one period, but I think it was more of them just playing high percentage and safe. And we'll look at things. And like I said, we need to find our game here right from the first uh, puck drop. Next one up top, Arpan Basu, The Athletic. Uh, hey, it's for either one of you, but I'm just wondering if, if either of you felt that play should have been an icing before their, just before their second goal. I haven't looked at the play. I don't know. Ryan Rashog, TSN. Just on the, Yanni, on the, on the physical aspect, Kevin Shattenkirk was saying that maybe after playing the Islanders and the style that they had, playing a team that was just in your face so much the way Dallas was, maybe took a bit for you guys to adjust to. Would you agree with that? And what did you sense from them kind of physically early and in, in your team in responding? I think they, uh, uh, they have a good gap. Uh, they're right on top of us. Uh, they skate, they skate very well. Um, uh, yeah. And definitely they, um, they, they were uh, on top of us uh, right, right from the get go. So we got to adjust and uh, do a better job. Diana Nero's Tampa Bay Times. Um, uh, before the game, um, Cooper said, you know, the first game is a feeling out process. Did it seem like that maybe took you guys a little bit longer to figure out Dallas than for Dallas to figure out you guys? I think we could have done better with our puck decisions. And, um, you know, like I said, they're, they're a fast skating team. We need to play at a higher pace anticipate our next play. Uh, we talk about being predictable, knowing where each other are on the ice, and we need to communicate better so we can play at that pace. And um, like I said, we got to uh, do that right from the first puck drop game too. Joe Smith, The Athletic. That's one for Yanni. Obviously, you guys had some opportunities in the third, in the power play, and a lot of good looks. Uh, just what have you seen from the group in this stretch uh, to the needs to kind of get a break here? Um... Uh, we, uh, yeah, we were better in the third period for sure. Um, but uh, we got to do a better job of uh, taking his eyes away. Uh, he's seen most, most of the pucks. Um, and I mean, like Ryan said, we got to play that, that type of game for, for 60 minutes. Uh, we can't really do that for 20 minutes. We'll do two more in English and then we'll do one in French for Yanni. Brian Compton, NHL.com. Ryan, you guys clearly had your legs in the third. Do you think the, the consecutive overtimes against the Islanders and the quick turnaround had any impact in the early going of this game? Thanks. No, like I said, I think we were playing slow. It wasn't with, uh, you know, because we didn't have energy or whatever. Um, we knew it was a quick turnaround. We knew what we were up against. And um, we just were shooting ourselves a little bit in the foot and they were on top of us and we needed to play with a higher pace and um, give them a lot of credit. They, uh, they got to the strength of their game more than we did. And that's, uh, you know, a reason why they found a way to win game one. Eric Erlinson, Lightning Insider. Yeah, for Ryan, the game one against Boston, you guys were a little tentative in that game and kind of ended the third period the same way. Were you surprised maybe some ways it was a little tentative to start this game too, considering it's game one of the Stanley Cup final? I mean, I just... I'm not surprised. I'm just disappointed in the fact that we, uh, you know, got away from our, our strengths. And like I said, give them credit. They're great skating, great structured team. Um, but I think we could have played to our strengths a little bit better, simplified our game, 
and, um, you know, get going north a little bit more early on there and, and allow ourselves to uh, so-called find our game with our forechecking and our offensive zone play. Um, but no doubt that's a great skating team over there and, and uh, they make it tough on you and they're going to continue to make it tough on us. So we've got to be ready for the challenge. Ryan, thank you very much for the time. You can be excused. We'll do one question in French here for Yanni. We'll go back to the media center. J.F. Chamont, Journal de Montreal. Salut Yanni. Pour, pour les deux premières périodes, qu'est-ce qui représentait le plus grand défi? Est-ce que c'était de faire abstraction de la fatigue ou de vous adapter au style de jeu des Stars, une équipe qui ne donne pas beaucoup de chances de marquer? Je pense que c'est plus euh, la façon qu'on a joué en les deux premières périodes. Euh, je pense qu'on n'a pas joué dans notre, euh, euh, dans notre système. Euh, puis euh, on n'est pas sorti assez fort. On n'a pas joué à, à, à la vitesse qu'on joue d'habitude. Euh, puis euh, ça nous a vraiment fait mal en début de match. Puis euh, jusqu'à ce qu'on trouve un petit peu plus nos jambes en troisième période, puis on soit un petit peu plus, euh, euh, on, on joue dans, notre, dans, dans nos forces. Yanni, thank you very much for the time. Thank you.